This portion is brought to you by Puppy Sure, the all-natural goat milk replacer formulated for lactose intolerant pets. Good morning everyone, welcome to Happy Pets. My name is Mark Lopez and we are going to kick off our special series on Breeds of the Month. And since ako sobrang hili ko sa Rottweiler, of course, alam nyo na, yung pinakaunang breed na feature natin are Rottweilers. Um, it's no secret that I really love that breed. But beside me is a person who probably loves that breed a hundred, a thousand times more. Guys, this is Mr. John Bautista. John, please say hello to our viewers. Good morning, everyone. Let's start off. John, kailang ka naghilig sa aso? When do you remember the earliest time naghilig sa aso? My love for dogs started out with my father. 1980s pa. All right. We were we were we had a lot of German shepherds. Eventually, from German shepherds, we got our first Rottweiler, our second, our third, and then we met a few friends along the way. Okay. And now we have quite a lot. During that time, yung dad mo naturally transition to Rottweiler and then you can heal it. Did you ever foresee na you will go into another breed na aside from Rottweilers nung yung dad mo pumasok na dyan? Not really. Okay. Not really. At that time, siguro ano mga early 2000s. Uh -huh. After Rottweilers, we never really saw look ourselves. So, we never looked back. Well, we got Bull Mastiffs too. Okay. Pero, yun na yun. Oo, yun na yun. Did you always know that you were going to get this deep into this breed, even when you started? Ever since when we started, uh, first I started doing this enterprise with a friend of mine, okay. see Francis. Francis uh, saw this and I yeah. uh, kind of co-owned the, the kennel. It's, uh, and, but ever since when we started out, there was already a vision in place. What vision is that? Well, uh, it may be, it may sound a little too ambitious, pero the goal ever since was to breed Rottweilers that can compete in the worldwide scene. Locally, lo locally bred. Locally Rottweiler. bred Rottweilers. As mentioned in the previous episode, Rottweilers are not endemic to the Philippines, so they are, they are a European line. So, napakalaki no challenge na ginagawa ni John to breed these dogs to compete internationally? Well, yes. We're hoping we can get there. But you already have some now na medyo, I mean, not medyo, but are on the level. Well, I, I wouldn't say really on the level. We've had some success producing locally born Philippine champions. Yeah. We're hoping this guy will be one of them in the future. Looks like it. Uh, but we're really hoping that we can get there sooner than later. What, what, what are the attributes of a Rottweiler na talagang, you would say na talagang, they are the dogs for you? Well, uh, the, the thing na medyo talagang nakapag-attract sa akin dyan sa breed na yan is Rottweilers are a wash and wear breed. Okay. As in, maintenance is so small, it adapts to my lifestyle. Magaling na bantay, napakatalino, work, working dog sila. And, ayan, that's practically the reason why I stuck to them. Actually, that's all the time we have for this part. And I'd like to invite everyone to please watch the next series where we will show the extent of your paghihilig ni John with Rottweilers. Okay? So, um, that's it. That's goodbye for us for now. Always remember, happy pets, happy parents, Agri-TV, Hayo Pangaling! This portion was brought to you by Puppy Sure, the all-natural goat milk replacer formulated for lactose intolerant pets.